Well, you might have already heard of them, loud pops from fireworks. Oh, yes, it's that time of year, and today Wish TV Sierra Hignite met up with first responders. She joins us now with some reminders to keep us all safe and out of trouble this 4th of July season. Sierra? Yeah, guys, it's common for people to host their own 4th of July parties and set off their own fireworks. But it's also common for people to uh, acquire a few injuries during their at-home show. So I have some helpful tips to keep you out of trouble as you celebrate. When putting on your own fireworks show within Indianapolis city limits, time is of the essence. You can do fireworks from 5 p.m. to two hours after sunset. And on July 4th, um, you can do fireworks from 10 a.m. Uh, until midnight. Those times could vary depending on where you live. The location of your show is also key in avoiding any fines or tickets from law enforcement. You can fire them on your property. Uh, you're not allowed to fire them on other people's property unless you get permission uh, from them. That includes any empty parking lots you may find. First responders say it's important that if you're calling to make a complaint about fireworks, not to call 911 unless it's an emergency, but instead call 311. When you call 911 for non emergency things, is that um, the, the people who are calling for emergencies will get put on hold um, and they'll have to wait longer for, for, uh, to report their actual emergencies. This time of year, police say they see an increase in the number of people reporting shootings. We always see an uptick in calls around the time of fireworks going off 4th of July, things like that. Um, it is important to continue to call if you do think it is actually um, shots fired or something's going on in your neighborhood. A lot of calls also come in reporting injuries, specifically burns to the hands, face, and arms. One of the biggest problems is people will pick up fireworks that didn't go off and they will um, try to light them again and reuse them again, and that's where you get into trouble. First responders say, have fun, but be careful. Anytime you, you, you're dealing with some explosives, anytime you're dealing with fire, uh, the unpredictable can happen. It is recommended to have some kind of water source close to you when you're letting off fireworks to put them out after you let them off or in case of an emergency. You can head over to wishtv.com to find what firework ordinances are in your city. I'm Sierra Hignite, Wish TV News 8.